Welcome back to Neverwinter Nights. I am Marcus, and uh, thanks for joining me again after the uh, um, the episode of inventory management. Um, please ignore the last episode. I put a note in there. I gotta put a note in there. The last episode was unbelievable amount of time of me managing my inventory. Just incredible. Um, and then. Uh, <laughs> I finally realized what I was doing and I stopped recording, thank God. And then I went and did more management. You can see that I organized my potions. Just went total, total madness, um, analness. Um, and we're right here at the end. We have the nymphs thing, but we do have some other things to do. I think we're done with Daylene. Moonstone Mask, that's the art theft. Temple of Tear, I thought we did that. But, Black Lake, Samuel's Rescue, we have to go back. I'm not going to do that all the way back just to go into Black Lake and tell them that Samuel's back. They know Samuel's back. Uh, hints of Treasure's Intent. I might have sold that or just gotten, gotten rid of it. The Wailing of the Mar... Okay, that's the Water Davy. <laughs> I'm ready to turn that in. That leaves Beggar Nest, a missing brother. Jeremiah's brother, Torn. That's the ring that I have. Torn's ring. Which is right here. And that is in the Beggar's Nest. Jeremiah. Let's go quick do that one. Because some dude is waiting to hear from his brother. About his brother. Probably his brother did not survive. I think, I think Torn was... Uh, had joined the cult or something so but his brother is a decent sort and we should help him out because yeah yeah I'm lawful evil but you can still do good things when you're lawful evil you, you have your own different kind of, hey Shatner hey that that was not George Lucas that producer was John Lucas it just sounded like it, it just sounded like George Lucas no no, it was George. I remember talking to him. Shut up, Shatner! It was John Lucas. Oh, such a liar. You little bitch. Okay, let's send the you, Shatner. Um, God. He's such a liar. Him and her. What a little crap. But anyway, um, now we're going to go here to uh, the beggar's nest. And. Uh, find Jeremiah barricaded home so things in here I didn't do there is isn't there but because now it's solved they're probably all broken oops I'm going the wrong way I don't think I get monk speed till level 3 and I'm really not sure I'm gonna do more monk I kind of think I should because of my play style <clears throat> just get more attacks etc I think this is the guy whose brother was torn. So let's let him know what the dealio is. Hey, Jermaine. Hi, Dan. <laughs> I didn't make that sound, by the way. That was so. Wow, at least the zombies have stopped. Do you know anything about it? I'm worried about my brother. He was mixed up with some cult. I'd like to know where he is. Torn has never been gone this long. If he hadn't by the state northwest, well, that's my problem. Uh, dude, slow down. Stop drinking coffee. Um, I found this ring in the cult hideout. Recognize it? That, that's one of my brothers. He always had it with him. He's dead. I know it. I don't have much to give you. Just keep the keep the ring. It reminds me of how he died, not his life. Um. Yeah, okay. Keep safe out there. Dude, are, are you originally from Canada? No. Okay, good. That That's good. I mean, Canada's an awesome place. I love Canada. Canada's awesome. Um, they actually understand the concept of sharing. But anyway, um, we won't go there. It just sounded like, I don't know, this is weird. Anyway, um, so we got the ring, right? So, what, what? what's the hotkey for, probably I? Is that what it is? It is, it's I. So, does Torn Ring do anything? Uh-huh. So, why am I keeping it? Maybe it's worth something? Why did he give it to me? Uh. Is it part of some huge mega 
mecha uh, device that if you hold on to and you get one <laughs> you get another one in Shadows of Undertried and then you get another one in uh, Horrors of Underdark you put the three together and you get like a big metal suit I think that was Baldur's Gate wasn't it? Yeah, never mind. Golden Pantaloons there's a merchant here um... what? in the beggar's nest? Shining Serpent Inn. Okay, this is an inn. Huh. Is this where Samuel's gonna end up? This is where that annoying half halfling is, Harbin Ashen Smith. Screw you, screw you. <coughs> Happen. Freaking halfling. They're so little. Okay, let's. <laughs> How do I get out of here? What's, what's the exit? There it is. Okay. Yeah, I got lost. Deal with it. Oh, God. I'm still going the wrong way, aren't I? Um, let's go this way. Yeah. This way, then south one, and then we're good. Uh-huh. I guess I could jet out, right? But I'm there, so... And then from here... You know what? Let's just jet out. Because we're just going to talk to Ari after this. We're done. That was weird how he wanted to give us that ring. That worthless ring. You are a welcome sight as always. Uh huh. Is this visit in regards to the fourth water Davian creature? It is, Ari. All eagerly awaiting its recovery. As soon as we have the fourth component, we can begin the ritual to create the cure. Yeah, we're the ones that captured her in the first place, right? So... The cure will now be ours, Marcus. Neverwinter owes you a debt. It can never repay. All I can offer is this lump sum of 500 gold. Yeah, that's pretty good. Thanks, Ari. You have earned a place of honor <clears throat> among those who sought to aid Neverwinter mm -hmm. in these dark times. You will stand with us as the ritual to create the cure is performed. Yeah, I'm Are good. you ready to go to the ritual chamber? Yeah, then let's go. We shall waste no more time. Neverwinter has suffered long enough. It has. So have I. Hmm. Whoa, what is this? Hail! You have provided a great service to all of Neverwinter. Judge Olaf Oscar. As a token of Lord Nash's gratitude, he thought you might want to bear witness to the cure's creation. After all your hard work, yeah. before the ritual proceeds, however, the four assembled would each like the chance to speak with you and offer four? their personal thanks for what you have achieved. That seems reasonable. Thanks, uh, thanks, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Judge. Them, I must inform the town crier of the good news. Good. Yeah. Do that. Uh, wash my hands. Washy washy. Oh, it's holy water. I'm sorry. Okay, God. Um, yeah. Um, hey, Ari. Greetings to you. You are smoking are well it. Underway for the ritual. If all goes um, well, we will have the cure in just a few moments. That's awesome, Ari. And then afterwards, you and I. Like we say, you have proven valuable uh, beyond the average exterior you present. What? None of this would have been possible without your help. Ari, have you seen my hair? That's amazing. Average exterior? Uh, is there anything I should do? What happens now? You need to worry about anything. Mm -hmm. Your efforts got us this far. Average and exterior? Now the ritual will take care of the rest. Excuse me. Following uh, that, all right. I will see to your reward. Oh, oh. that sounds good. J you're gonna see to my reward? So you have something planned, Arya? Right. I, 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 I can get into that. Be done oh. to us. Oh. You've earned the right to bear witness, however. Right, and okay. And I'm sure the others would say the same. Mm, oh, yeah, well, most of them, yeah. Um, will things get back to normal now? Once we have the cure in hand, we will determine the best way to get it to the most people as soon as possible. It mm -hmm. will take time, so we'll treat the most severe cases of plague first, regardless of station. Right. I just hope 
the ones with the most we'll gold. Gotcha. That's the American system, so, yeah. We are very near our goal, but I can't help but worry about the effects of the plague. Yeah. There is a great scar across Neverwinter. You're right. You're Already right. Already I see the distrust. The mood of the city has changed. When all is done, the people will want someone to blame, and I don't know if we will find anyone. Oh, we, we, can, we can find someone, Ari. Don't worry about that. <laughs> where, there's a, where there's blame, there's a claim. So we will find someone. I was thinking uh, that old dude was helping Fenthic. Uh, what's his name? The guy with the pole up is... Uh, oh. I shouldn't ramble on like this when we are so close to a cure. Oh, you're awesome, girl. And we got here because of you. No problem. Okay. I'm certain they can speak for themselves, but I will answer any questions you have. I would ask whether your opinion of him has suffered. It was your efforts that brought us this far. His claims of action seem based on your results. While you searched, his Helmites blessed. While you fought, his Helmites blessed. Huh. The comfort he brought will pale next to the actual cure you have provided. Of course, he is needed for the final ritual, oh. so I cannot dismiss him entirely. Benthic also serves as his advocate, so he must be deserving of some respect. Yeah, speaking of Fenthic, um, so what's the story there, girl? I mean, uh, are you two still, you two still hanging, or? This time has been difficult, yeah. and our difference of opinion made it more so. Fenthic and I have had little to speak of besides the play. He doesn't see to your needs. You need someone who does. And girl, you know I'm there I for you. I understand why he vests so much hope in Desta, but I could not. Huh. I know the power of faith, but you need to back it up with action. That's what I'm saying. That is what I'm saying. Um, well, look, I should go and talk to them, but you don't move from the spot, girl. Because you and I have got some serious talking after this, don't you think? Yes, farewell for now. There is much I must do to prepare for the casting to come. Mm -hmm. The incantations are very complex. Gotcha. Okay. See you soon. You should speak with the others. Mm -hmm. No doubt they will each have their own feelings about how our situation has changed. Um, I might, you know. Fenthic's cool. But, yeah. Oh, well. How you doing, boys? It's me, the guy that actually saved the day. Fenthic, my man. A grand day, is it? And you, you, the thing. Yep. It was your effort that allowed us to... It was a team effort, buddy. You found the water even creatures. Aligned Death and his hell my brother to concentrate on helping the spirits of the people. Um, okay. Now you can instruct the cure and all will be well. I was happy to be part of the team, Fenthic. Yes, I knew you would be trusted. Just as I knew Death could prove would prove critical. Even now he, well, let's just say he is helping despite what others think. Others think? Really, Fenthic, now is not the time to talk. Others don't understand like you do. Of course, of course, it is better that we look forward. And but a few minutes we will have the cure. Um, what did you hesitate to tell me something? Oh, it was nothing, really. <laughs> nothing better left unsaid. It's a matter for Dester and I alone. You can tell me, buddy. You know I've proven trustworthy. Yes, yes you have. And I will not push you aside. I have seen my companions do that too much already. His companions? Is he talking about Ari? You see, Dester has been pushed out of the plans for the ceremony. His efforts to help are ignored. My companions mingle, but they are too untrusting. I think they know what they're doing, Fenthic. Uh, well, have you done something to help him? It's a small thing, really. I mean, he needs to help. He needs to help for the cure to work. He shouldn't be held back by suspicions now. He's proven himself. You see, for the cure to work, he needs to draw magical energies from the Temple of Hell. It's apparently very dangerous. It might kill him. Oh, that's too bad. Uh. Arabeth and the others would never allow it. So I gave him the key, my key for the wards protecting Castle Never. The magic of Helm will aid in our spell. Um, doesn't that leave the castle unprotected? Of course not. I would never endanger the castle. That sort of simply channel a little Helm of energy to help the cure be as potent as possible. Uh huh. There is no danger. The wards are still in place. No one can enter or leave without alerting those of us with keys. What do you think Arabeth would think of this? Arabeth, I love her dearly, but her eyes have been closed by the horror of the plague. 
I must do this for the good of us all. You will see. Okay, Fan. I trust you too. Alright. Yes, this is best that I concentrate on what is coming. I will have to be very careful not to disturb the incantation such as others during the ritual. You should speak with Desert and Lord Natcher. While their views of the coming ceremony are no doubt it's different, it would be wise to speak with both of them. Uh huh. Yeah. Alright. Um. Sure. Is this the creep right here? Dealing! Chill! Hush! Oh. Um. Alright, um. I'm just trying to get situated here. Um. Yeah. Well, uh, hello. That's sir. I imagine you are well pleased with Hello, you, Dester. This is your doing, after all. Getting the cure? Yeah, it is my doing. Um, we also have to get a cure in our own way. Perhaps, although it was definitely your thuggish actions that brought us to this point. You overstepped my helmet, brethren, very effectively. Bravo. What? Of course, now it is time for you to step aside. The ritual will not require you. You may watch as we create the plague cure, but do not interfere. Huh. By the way, Dester, uh, why did Venthic give you the Castle Never Key? That is my affair. I explained my need to Fenthic, and he saw the wisdom in it. Getting the proper result from the ritual requires a certain amount of risk. Magical risk, or tempting the wrath of, say, Erebeth? Well, that is certainly part of it. Erebeth dislikes me, and it makes her difficult to deal with. I'm not sure what Fenthic sees in her, really. Yeah, super hot, high-level paladin, elf, yeah. It's a mystery. I doubt she could provide a real proven reason for her distrust. Fenthic is more understanding. He knows that faith is a powerful tool. Huh, you must admit that it seems odd. Perhaps to you, but this whole ritual is beyond your understanding. You may rest assured the cure was successfully created. Uh huh. And what is it you intend to do, Esther? I'm going to fulfill my promises and make sure the cure is successfully created. There is no other purpose to the ceremony. Hmm. Well, let's go back to some uh, other questions. As you will, but do try to hurry. You know, I'm, that's fine. Yes, let me cancel the ritual to come. Goodbye, Marcus Talbot. I'm sure you're proud of all you've done. Why, well, I believe you have to speak with Lord Nasher. You should do so before we commence the ritual. He is your lord, after all. Yes, sir. You are such a twit. Mm. Lord Nasher, we should talk, man. Well, you must be the one oh. Erebeth has told me of. I must say that I appreciate what you have done. No problem, sir. It was my pleasure. I am pleased that we could count on the average wayfarer to rise up and help Neverwinter with this Average time. wayfarer? Um... Questions about your fellows. Information about my trusted advisors. I suggest you ask them yourself. They have been instructed to be cooperative. Does that extend to each other? You are referring to the disagreements between Erebeth, Fenthic, and yeah. Esther. Yes, they have had different ideas about how to fight the plague. I demanded it. Hmm? I have no use for advisors and officers who merely parrot each other. I wanted every option covered, regardless of whether everyone was in agreement. And now it's clear Erebeth was right to suggest that you help. And Fenthic was also wise to advocate for Dester as aggressively as he did. The cure will soon be ours. Yeah, I about Fenthic. Though I would request that you make it brief. Alright, sir. I must report that Fenthic says he gave his ward key to I Dester. I ask you not to push into the affairs of my trusted advisors. Fenthic has my full confidence. And by his word, I trust Dester to act responsibly. Do not concern yourself with it. Hmm. Castle Neverwinter is well fortified, and nothing shall disrupt the ritual. The cure is all that matters now. Farewell, sir. Yes, it is best that we commence with the ritual. Ready yourself. The play begins with this. Hope to guide your right, sir. To the deities. All right, uh... What the hell? It worked! We have the cure! Yes, Fenthic. I have the cure. What? What? What do you mean? A 
attack? Oh, son of a bitch! Ow! That's their Fenthic! What the hell's going on? Look at these dicks. Get him! Get him, Daylene! God damn! Is that it? No, there's one more. Okay. That's it. What the hell just happened, Ari? What? Get Dester and and Fenthic too. He may be under a spell. I don't know. Fenthic went with Dester? Imagine. I must wish Fenthic harm rather than face the. No, Fenthic's on our side. That he might have known of this. No. Fenthic's a good guy. I'm sure there's there's more to this than we know. He went to stop him, of course. If he had a part in this. Gary, how can you even say that? He looks like he fled with Destin. The people will not accept this action. He did not... The people won't let this pass. They have been denied a cure, and they will want vengeance on the traitor and anyone that helped him. I won't be able to protect him. I won't. We don't know the story yet, Ari. Settle down. I, there's no way the Fenthic is in this. Uh, uh, Destin, absolutely. But Fenthic, no. Perhaps... Perhaps delivering Dester will mitigate things. I'll Find get him. Find him alive if you can. Find Fenthic and get him to... I don't know. I don't know what will help now. Where does this portal go? It's hard to tell. I can't see through Dester's magic. It probably leads to wherever he and his false hell knights originally came from. No, make them pay. Dester claimed he came from Helm's Hold in the East, but I don't know how that could be true. They would have no part of a pod like this. I don't think we can believe anything that came out of Dester's mouth, the Ari. Leads, I'm sure it will be dangerous. He must know we would send someone after him. Be careful. I'll go as quickly as I can. The are needed elsewhere, so this task falls to you. Go before the portal falls. We'll do, Ari. I'll get this. I'll get this taken care of. <sighs> wow. Okay. Well, join me next time when we pursue. Uh, Dester, that asshat, who stole the cure. Did he actually make it? He has the cure, but he stole it. And he retreated here to his base. And Fenthic ran after him, hopefully to stop him. I guess we'll see. Join me then.